Next up on Howler for an hour, we have Mask of Mist. Honestly, I'm really eager to play this, partly because it just looked really neat. Kind of has a... Has, the art style kind of makes me think of World of Warcraft, actually. But partially because it's really neat, like the game concept for what I saw on trailers. Also, partially I'm just excited to play a game because we spent like an hour through technical difficulties because Steam decided it would like to break the stream. Um, but I'm good now, so let's continue, see how things go, and let's play this game. The story begins with another job challenge. You were asked to find the missing person. It was nothing unusual. Except for the fact that this person was an Archmage of the Academy! And as you know, untraceable disappearances are extremely unusual for Archmages. Archmages. Archmage Kral protected his research in, on infected territory, the area of fierce battles during the last war of the Empire. The amount of magic which fell on this land was so huge that it weakened the barrier that protected us from the Abyss, and many of its inhabitants filled this area. You were promised a triple size fee in case of success, and the Archmage's colleagues kindly offered to teleport you directly to your destination. Triple size? It's not like a. That's like sounds like a burger, right? I'd like to triple size the fries. You enter the portal after hesitating for a few moments. Straightforward story, to the point, didn't take too long. Let's get into the game. Yep. Yeah. Seems pretty good so far. Here's what you're doing. Go do it. <laughs> Here's a mask. Is it the mask of this? Perhaps. Whoosh! Alright. Just, just gonna see something real fast. I wish there was more, uh, how to put it, dynamic options for graphics quality. Because I bet if I hit low, it'll probably remove the shadows, won't it? How's your FPS? Just a little low. Let me adjust this. It, I'm currently adjusting it. I could probably play just fine with that setting, but... Ah, uh, yeah, it's a bit better. Okay. What's this? That's the mask, I guess. So here we are. Find out what happened to the Archmage. Okay. Oh, we can jump. Okay, good. I will climb things and get out of bounds. Oh gosh, the game glitched out. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Red statuette. Okay. This seems interesting. I can't... Even though it's very interesting and looks like the thing of the title, I can't pick up that mask for some reason. There's another one here. Oh, there's tons of masks. Okay. I guess they're not that special after all. Hmm. He thinks I have a puzzle here. There's collectibles or something. Oh, it's a bush. That sound was so high and treble, I thought it was like a snake hissing at me. I don't know what these red statuettes are for, but I'm gonna take them. Well, I assume I'm looking for four cubes, because there's four pedestals for cubes. Is there going in a particular water? Does not matter? Oh, the statuettes need to go in it. Okay. So what are these for? <laughs> I actually have no idea. I will bring the cubes. We'll go there for now. Oh, I do have a I do have a sprint. It's kind of a weird teleport sprint. Oh wow, that is sending me too far actually. That's a weird sprint. I like it though. 
Blue flower. Okay. There's another blue flower there. I'm not entirely sure where we're going or what we're doing. This seems to be a town. Lever's broken, needs to be replaced. I have a flower, will that fix it? What's this? The remains of a town, yeah. Ooh, that was kind of interesting how that loaded in. <laughs> this has a nice aesthetic to it, I like it. Carrot! Also for cooking. Start the fire requires firewood six. I can't do that. I don't have firewood six. Hinges of the hatch rested a long time ago. Can't open it. Okay. Oh, it's a puzzle. <laughs> Uh, the game... Actually, could somebody change the description of the game to Mask of Mists? Please. Oh, I have a sword. This will probably be a fortune in a minute. Fort Terrace key needed, okay. Not a bad form. It seems as a bad form serving me as an extra shell for near future. More of it can be managed to open the patch of work shape. Main thing not to forget the correct sequence. Um, arrows R B fish M. 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 Arrows R. B fish M. All right, I'll go in there in a minute. I'm kind of curious though. There's an outside area. I didn't finish exploring it, and now I have a sword. Now we can go from theft to murder. No, no, this is an abandoned town. <laughs> it's fine. It's not theft if it's if nobody's around ever. They all left. Abandoned property, friend. Rule rule of rule of cool. You can take from an abandoned property. It's fine. Okay, so what do we got? What do we know? We need a lever for that. We got something going on in there I'll check out in a minute. There's a chest up there. Hmm. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> I didn't think I could do that. Alright. <laughs> Can't hop anymore though, it doesn't let me hop here. That's alright. Hold on, I'm gonna, I, I know there's probably some way to the access that balcony nice and smooth. This game, this, if you're not on a solid platform, you can't jump in this game, I realize. Oh yeah, I could totally get that chest from here. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, I need to get the items. How do I get the items? <laughs> I can open it! <laughs> I did not think this plan through. It's fine. Oh, well, that opens. Okay. I had such a good idea, though, for a moment. All right, all right. Let's go back into the building. There's clearly a lot I can do out here. Wait, hold on. Oh, there. No. I was like seeing if I could stand on the blocks. If if so, I could build a staircase. I only have two, but. No, they're, they're not, they can't go past through them, so. All right, where does this lead us? Oh, I thought this would be like a dungeon. Oh, look, another cube. You don't know any recipe. Oh, okay, well. I can't find Fort Terrace Key anywhere. I must have dropped it again when I was working on my last picture. I never thought that such a harmless hobby could cause so much inconvenience. This is kind of neat. What do we got here? This picture looks unfinished, okay.
A lot of masks in here. He even goes to bed with his masks. To cook this potion, you'll need a blue flower and a witch mushroom. Anti-rust potion. Why would I need an... Oh, it's maybe to fix something that's rusted. Um... Okay, well, this is a cube, and that's... I don't know what that is. Should I just collect the cubes in here? I don't know what I should do with these. I guess I could take them through loading zones. I'm gonna collect them in here. This looks like an important place. Get the orbs with the cubes on the ceiling. Oh, there's orbs on the... Okay, thanks. But let's see if I can pick up more cubes. And let's see if I can switch them between maps. I'm not... I'm actually kind of interested to find out. Oh, look! I am allowed to move them between areas. Storage key. So wait, are these like useful? I thought they were like puzzles or something. Like puzzle blocks, but maybe they're just here for us so I can throw shit. They're both. Well, okay. I guess I'll bring this one back outside then. So I got a storage room key. Let's see. Was there a locked door? Wait, did I actually... These weren't locked. This was locked. Four terrace keys needed for that one. Right, where does the storage key go then? I don't suppose... So, yeah, this is rusted. I have an anti-rust potion. It requires a, a witch mushroom or something. So I need that to fix that so I can go down there. Okay. Seems to be a puzzle game, but I have a sword too, so... But thinks there's going to be some mix of puzzle and action. I can't get it. I was trying to see what it was. <laughs> All right, so well, let's check out this building next then. This song almost makes me think of the Shire music from Lord of the Rings. I think it could stack cubes to get up. Oh. It was at this moment that I realized crates are breakable. <laughs> I tried hitting another random object earlier and it didn't do anything, so. I have a pad. I have a lever. Oh, it's a lever. It's convenient. I should probably go back to the other house and see what else I can break. It's really starting to pan out. I'll put the pad on the cooking stove and I'll use the lever on the broken lever section. Which is, uh. Though, in addition to broken levers, there's also the working le lever, which we can go through as well. I require a partner status on Twitch. That's a slime. I'll fight that in a second. Our first enemy. First though, I'm, I really am curious. Because there is that balcony. Actually, how- Oh, wait a minute. I'm dumb. I know exactly how to get to that balcony. Also, here, have a pan. Cool. I don't know what that exactly accomplished, but cool. It's fairly obvious what can be broken. This. I 
This doesn't lead outside though, so I guess I it's the fork. Oh. Well, I got the stove mask. Well, the game's about masks, so that's probably important. Do I have like an inventory? I do. Strange bird like beak mask. As in, I need partner status. Charm already has one. What the fuck? No, I don't have partner. I've been trying to get partner for. <laughs> I've repeatedly expressed how I need 75 average viewers for partner. How did you think I already had partner? I've been wanting this for a long time. <laughs> I don't have it. <laughs> Please don't spread it for this information. Now everybody's gonna be like, oh, he already has partner. We don't have to try anymore. <laughs> no, 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 I don't have partner. I don't have it. I want to get partner, but I never have enough viewers for that. I three years and counting, still don't have partner. It's fine. It's just kind of annoying. <laughs> partner is also a good mark to the number of viewers I would actually be most comfortable to have. Like, 75 viewers is an awful lot, but that's a good number, because that means I can always have somebody to talk to. Um, granted, 30 viewers seems pretty good for that, too, but... Actually, what? how many viewers do we have right now, by the way? So why do you have these options that only partners have? Oh, Drake. When was the last time you looked at what partners and affiliates have? Because Twitch has done updates over the last couple years, giving affiliates a lot of, a lot of things that partners used to only have exclusive access to. Which is probably why you're confused. Die. I stopped noticing I existed. I did it. What's over here, though, actually? This lever took no effort to go into. Ah, Look, affiliate gives a lot of important things, so I'm happy to have affiliate. Seems the last owner disappeared through this gap at the end of the battles. The cursory inspection showed it is necessary to find and activate six navigation crystals open safely. Those are not usually placed in the ground, not far from placing the gap, so I think I can easily find them. I do have to say, I wish this game had a slightly better frame rate, but I'll accept the 23 frames that I have. It's still enough to play the game. Also, lowering the settings didn't really seem to do much to the frame rate. Is there anything left I could lower? No, not really. I could probably get into the internal config file and fix something that way, but... A piece of excellent fertile land. In other words, I'm saying I'm poop. All right. Brushwood. We're in all that perfectly good grass and then stepping into it after stepping on poop, so now the grass has poop on it. A bridge too far. You know, you give me a broken bridge that I can't cross, I just think to myself, maybe I can cross this anyways. Never mind, they put up invisible walls. Smart, smart boyos. But are they enough? too slopey to jump. Yeah, but no, I know how this the jumping is handled and such that it checks to see if you're on what it counts as solid ground before letting you jump again. If I'm on ground that isn't solid though, there might be like a millisecond where it thinks I'm on solid ground and I could jump again. I'm very close. Hold on. I bet I could trick it. So you need to find the right spot. They added too many slopes here. This, okay, that's just literally an invisible wall. But here. This looks potentially useful. I 
by here. Game's pretty good. Game's okay. I'll, I'll give up. You know what? Good work, Gabe. You prevented me from breaking you. It's actually pretty good. Like it's kind of hard to prevent me from breaking games. So that's you know commendable effort. They placed that well. That also looks like a jumping puzzle. Oh. All right. Um. All right. Back to the way I'm supposed to go. Oh, wow. You have no idea what it is, but it's better not to touch it. Let's touch it. A strong burning sensation runs through your fingers. You pull your hand away in a hurt owl. I mean, I guess what did I expect, right? Okay, I'm still wearing his mask, even in death. I mean, that's a reasonable consequence. Oh, I increased my maximum health using a runestone. It did not heal me, though. Kind of look around and look some crannies, though, because there's hidden items here and there. It's a wood mushroom. It's not a witch mushroom, though. Like, I only took one. The other three, fuck them. They're not big enough? I don't know. Oh, hi there. Can't see what I'm doing. Oh, I found the strategy. You stay at a certain distance so they just have to keep following. It's perfect. Mushrooms look like one in Skyrim. Old tree, it seems it will not be difficult to cut it down. But now with a sword. Is that another broken bridge? This happens a lot, I notice. Alright, hold on. What did I get this time? Another bee bird mask, okay. Alright. Oh, I I Hold on, this is even this is an even smaller gap than last time. Let me fuck around a minute. Okay, there's an invisible wall blocking me for lying on that. Okay. Smart move. Can I stand on this? Oh, I can? Really? That's interesting. By the way, you drop like a stone the moment you're in midair. It's kind of interesting. So, uh, timing a jump like this? Very difficult. Quite possible, though. I don't think that gives me enough clearance, but it's pretty close. Oops. Yeah, I can't do that. Once again, I commend the game designers. They're preventing me from doing what I want to do. Which, in this situation, is wise. All right, let's uh, let's see what's over here. Hello, creepy thing in the tree. How you doing? Seemed for a moment there was someone inside the hollow. Inspect. You don't find anyone. Okay. Well. Twas a ghost. Bad platform with no coyote frames. No coyote frames for us. Blinky guy. Um. It's very pretty, but I hope I find a dungeon or something, because I'd like to fight some shit. I mean, yeah, the slimes are fine, but like... Oh, well, that's not a slime. What are you? Oh, a spitty guy. That's, that's very rude. Ow, poison. Ow! What's up? I don't think it's poison. I think it just slows you. I'm beat up really bad. <laughs> The enemies, the enemies are not fooling around. I take that. That would be useful. I 
I do have health potions. Q. Okay. If I get hit again, I'll take. I'll keep that in mind. Um. Oh, it's a tree. Gross, you got purple on you. Dude, I'm a Shadox. I have purple on me all the time. Oh, this is open. I think we found an actual dungeon. Hold on a minute, though. Before I do that, there's a, well, there was one other path. That looks like a dungeon. This game... I don't know. This game just gave me the impression it probably have dungeons. So I was looking out for one. Maybe just pop a pot now? Pop will pop a pot when he pleases. <laughs> there. It's a little bit of alliteration for you. Oh, it's a witch mushroom. Well, time to go all the way back to where we were. If you're not sure why I say that, you'll understand. I really want to know what's in the cellar of the place where I got a sword. Maybe I'll get a better sword. What's this? Seems a rabbit is hiding in the depths of the hole. Try to get the rabbit out. Try to pull her out of the hole that bites you. Rabbit's gonna murder me. Rabbit acquired taste for human flesh. Rabbit has now become carnivore. Darn. Where did I get up there, actually? Hmm. Oh, past the broken bridge? No? Like, I'm mentally tracing the route. Do I have a map? I don't have a map. Mentally tracing the route, and I don't see how you would get up there. Oh, perhaps through here. That would make sense. The rabbits eat meat. That's more plant for me. I'll say you. Alright, let's see. I think the side station was over here. Corn's good. God, you know, I'm kind of stressed out because of earlier. I kind of want to get some... I want kind of want to order burgers again. I wonder if I should do that, though. What time is it? It's certainly early enough for me to do so. Maybe after this game, I don't know. I can't, well, here's the thing about cubes, yo. Let me show this off again, since I didn't make this, apparently I didn't make this clear. Let me demonstrate what's wrong with cubes. First off, well, the important thing to note here is that cubes and me were intangible to each other. Look. So they're not useful. If I could pick up this, I would be useful because I could stand on it, but. Um, yeah. By the way, here's how this is gonna work. The moment I see an enemy, I'm gonna I'm gonna drink the pot. I don't have that many, so I'm just yeah. So let's see, the cellar, huh? Game is giving me a fair number of health po I don't know what happens if we die. It might just like restart us from the area, or it might be like, okay, we're healing. <laughs> Hi. Fuck you. Fuck you. Quarters are useful. I'm kind of curious about saying. Ha <laughs> ha asshole. Wait, hold on. There. There we go. Cool, I have a ghost sword. It can attack through walls. <laughs> uh, the creatures of the abyss can barely take on a variety of forms. Some of them are tangled tentacles growing out from the ground several times higher than human growth. These creatures are absolutely dangerous, but what surprises them absolutely not tolerate meat subjected to heat treatment. This is a real poison for them. They can't eat cooked meat. I like this game, by the way. I'm kind of digging it. I got a rabbit trap. Now they won't bite me. I can go heal and get a rabbit now.
So yeah, what do you guys think though? Should I get burgers or should I just stick to food here? I there is still when Aragon makes spaghetti as he did uh, uh, three days ago, uh, he makes such a large portion that we can eat that for a week. So I could have some spaghetti. I'm just not really in a spaghetti mood. Oops, wrong way. So I'm debating right now. Stick to what you have. Best to use what you have. Well, yeah, that's true. All right, I'll have spaghetti then. First world problems, I know, right? Wait. Where was the rabbit again? I went the wrong way. Though, though I should go in there, but... Oh, you know, I, I do actually have the resources necessary to make grilled cheese sandwiches. So I could do that. That also sounds pleasant. That is almost... I mean, it's not a burger, but it has a similar appeal. When you get levers, mix other stuff with it. Okay, spaghetti and... Grilled cheese and spaghetti of them. Got it. Where the fuck am I going? Sounds funky. I don't know about that either, but... Tell you what, though, the, the spaghetti was made with uh, little pieces of sausage. I could take a bit of the sausage out of the spaghetti and put it in the grilled cheese. That wouldn't be terrible. That would not be terrible. Now, where the fuck was this rabbit? Oh, it's over here. That's right. Sorry, food distracted me. Imagine if you have max health up when it first started to grab the rabbit and just killed you. It could have. It's a trap. I do have a carrot. Well, that's why I have the carrot. Trap a set, put carrot. Alright. There it is. That sounded very magical for a wooden trap. Hold on. Oh, fuck. Still not? Okay, fine. Raw meat! Wow, that instantly killed the rabbit. Okay, I get it. I need to cook the meat. How, though? Oh, the fire. Haha. <laughs> okay, let's do this dungeon first. I immediately solved the puzzle with the vines. We gotta cook the meat on the pan and then give it to the vines and it dies and I can go through the vine path. What's well, in here first? Now, this is a proper dungeon. Time to explore, I guess. This place is kind of big, actually. There we go. All right. That's where we came from. All right. A lot of paths, but they all are kind of just paths and switches, so that's pretty simple. Let's go this way, then. Huh. 
Okay, look at. Game saved. Moon. Sun. I heard traps. Moon, sun. If you're wondering how I solved that, I noticed that there's were these, and I assumed those meant sun, so I tried that out. Of curiosity. Yeah, that's solved. Okay. Save this dungeon is filled with aggressive purple blobs. Looks like it'd be a nice place to record the house of Satan. Well, at least turns and twists? I don't know. Alright. There was clearly something over here. That was to be annoying. Haha! <laughs> okay, I have a bunch of torchies here. The time being, let's just light them all. That might actually be the solution, I don't know. Nope. Oh, not you again. Wait, I don't have to deal with you. Oh shit, not this way. Nope, 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 hold on. There we go. This guy, this guy could be fuck me up pretty good if I let him. Um. Really resembles the plan of a room. Triangle, not the outer ones on the middle side. Okay. Activate navigation crystal? Sure. It's a boring way to put the solution to the puzzle. Yeah, I mean, like, I mean, it didn't really call it, solve, didn't really make it too hard to solve, so. Well, I activated that. What that did? Yo, oh, yeah, I'm sure those bookcases aren't a secret pa Wait, what? Did I miss a secret passage? <laughs> Maybe? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> right, let me know when I'm- it wasn't right- it's- <laughs> Let me know when I get close to it, I guess. Oh, these are still active. Of course they would be. Where was this bookcase? 
actually took very little time to get back. I mean, these? They do look kind of suspicious. But... Nope. Wait. No. It does seem oddly, f like, framed and separated out like that. I think it's just bookcases, though. I can't seem to find anything, so... Let's cross our fingers at Navigation Trist, so let's relieve twice. Yes, good. Not that backtracking would be the worst thing, but I don't want to throw my face in that flame bro floor trap- that flame- that flame singer trap that I have to go against, no. Actually, that's- that's kind of- I've actually been kind of trained to watch for the dots, so... Alright, let's go back, cook the meat, f serve the meat to the evil plant, profit, I kind of just have everything mapped out on my head at this point. We have enough firewood to start the fire so we can actually cook the food. Now we cook the food. Frying the meat. We take the fried meat. Straightforward enough. Let it have that. It dies. I thought it was gonna die off screen. Okay, I appreciate that. All right. Well, do you think the Bay of the Abyss would be something less common? I mean, uh. oh fuck! That one noticed me. I thought I didn't notice me. Asshole. Ow. Wait, I can just move. I don't need to. I don't like when he moves because it throws off his timing. It's like I, I expect him to shoot and then he moves a little bit instead of shooting and it throws me off. Alright, what we got? Well, that was easy. All right, do I need any more dolls? I assume I need more dolls. Eh, what? Let's go up here first. You know, this game is perfectly competent, but there's just something not grabbing me about it. I don't know what it is, though. The amount of magic containing these small statues is simply amazing. Even being buried in the ground, these statues literally burn the grass growing above them, and they can turn black and gradually die. Huh. Well, I mean, I'm kind of dying here and there. Well, looks fragile and has to blow up. I like how, like that guy's way of thinking thing, things through. <laughs> um, all right, let's see here. What do we got over here? What, what's going on here? Shovel. Okay. Mental note taken. This place needs shovels and bombs. It's just, I guess, it seems too straightforward or something. Like, I don't think it's bad, it's just... Oh, wait, yeah, I came here. Wait, hold on, I have an axe. Shit, fucking... Give me a second. Silver so kind trees, oh, okay. I get it now. 
Yeah, see, I can't stun lock that if you're wondering. I don't like those guys. Definitely prefer getting them stuck in corners. You'll not pass here. Okay, Gandalf. <laughs> oh, you want to challenge me then? I see how it is. Oh, I can jump with this. All right. Oh. Well, guess what? Fuck you. I, I passed here. Oh. Oh, I finally, I finally, I finally out outsmarted the game, guys. Okay, let's, uh... I passed there! Alright, um... Runes of Well, Rope Decayed Long Time Ago. Okay. Can't tell me what to do. Okay, definitely need a shovel. Fort Terrace Oh, that was just kind of over there, wasn't it? Oh, great buttons. Oh, great mushrooms and stuff. Right, 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 right. Can't solve that yet. Let me guess, Terrace has a shovel. It does... I think I know what's starting to bother me about this game. It's really, it's really forcing a back and forth, isn't it? Okay, I have a pistol now. What does this shoot, though? Oh, that. That's the other ammo type. Okay. I didn't realize the other thing was ammo, but apparently it is. Cartridge. Fair enough. Yes, yeah, so I realized. I guess I wasted a shot. That's fine. Whatever. I don't care that much. Ah, here's the other side of this. Well, at least there's sh a shortcut. It's only a one-way shortcut, so... <sighs> right, how many symbols do we have? And they're the same on each? Right. Well, I guess I technically I could I could sequence break this if I was really smart. I'm, there's only four symbols that, that wouldn't take too long to crack, but I'm not really feeling it either. If the four if four turrets has a shovel though, oh my god, I'm gonna SMH. Okay, Can't help noticing the shape under the cubes. Wait, what? Circle, diamond, square, and triangle. I don't actually know what this puzzle is, though. <laughs> clues is elsewhere. It might still technically be a back force just to find the clues to it, though. You know, I have I have papers, but I don't actually know. Inventory, inventory, inventory. Like this is my inventory, but. I don't know how I can access my papers. I'm perplexed if there actually is a way. Wait, hold on. 
Game's, the game never told. Oh, journal, J. Do, 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 do. No, none of those help me. All right. I'm also getting lost here. No, there is not a map. Okay. <laughs> Thought not, but figured I'd double check that. Oh, yeah. Our favorite habitat of apricots is trunks of old trees. These creatures are usually harmless before they already sell the items they found for rubies. Oh. Maybe I should go over there first, then. Those are... fiery flowers. <laughs> Alright. Fire flowers, but a much more hardcore version than the one we, we have in Mario. Um, what about the cave you ignored at the chest? I'll go there in a minute. I want to go visit the leprechaun real fast. I have been picking up rubies for a while. Okay, where was the leprechaun though? Let me just like... Oh fuck, I don't remember. I don't remember anything. God damn it. This place isn't quite distinct enough from area to area for me to remember where I'm going. He's over here. It's somewhere. Oh, for fuck's sake. Where are you, Leprechaun? There you are. Off a ruby. <laughs> Leprechaun is ready to sell you his goods. What do we got? Old map! That might help me, actually. <laughs> what do magic beans do, though? Old map. Oh god, it's something in a cabbage patch? Alright. No, it'd be a treasure map. That'd be a map map. Leprechaun is ready to say use goods. I don't have anything else. Thank you. They say these beans can grow up to several, several meters in seconds. Well, I have magic beans now. Oh, wait. Where was the fertilizer? <laughs> Where was the poop? Wasn't it over here? No, it was near mushrooms, though. It definitely was. Can I see those beans? No, you'll eat them. You'll have a bean stuck in your stomach. Wait a minute. Sorry, just thinking about saying. Nothing happens. All right, cool. <laughs> that was worthwhile. Wait, that wasn't. Was that lit up before? Oh, these are the navigation. Oh, the navigation crystals are probably doing that, aren't they? So it looks like there's six of them. Yeah, it did say there was six. Okay, so that's what that's for. Well, let's. We'll go to the cave, but since we're going through town anyways, hold on. Game's got a bit of content, yeah. Oh, okay, this leads to this. Alright, what did I get? Recipe for health po- I don't need that, really, but okay. What about over here? 
bullets and a ruby. Okay. Well, that solves that at least. Nope. I am trying my like I'm actually I'm actually kind of racking my brain to remember where I'm going because the paths are so fucking meandering. <laughs> Shovel's in this cave, then. Or maybe something to make the magic beans grow. Or maybe something to take out the fire flowers. Let's see, what, see what's in here, then. By the way, so far we've only fought two enemy types. I wonder if that'll change. Oh, for fuck's sake. Do you not move, or...? Guess not. I'll fight him the slow, tedious, but safer way. Oh, for fuck's sake! I don't like these enemies. What's this thing? Oh. Three enemy types, two are identical. Nearly identical. Yeah, those those guys there that spit, there's a moving type and there's a not moving type. They're otherwise identical. We're also having the same music we just heard in the previous level. Which I find mildly lame, I guess. I think I found the strategy for fighting these guys. Basically, don't even need to run away, just need to kind of back up occasionally. And there's a shovel. When you clear a dungeon for a goddamn shovel, that, that certainly is something, isn't it? Okay, I can't. These platforms are a lie. Um, there's two spots for shovel. Fuck me, I'm gonna have to try to remember. This game is being mean to me in the sense that it's forcing me to remember in situations I don't remember well in. Right, let's try to find the two shovel spots. I do remember one was kind of just in a bush somewhere, which I'm gonna be like, oh god, where was that, you know? Just find black grass. Oh yeah, there was actually a hint about that, wasn't there? Yeah, statuettes buried in the ground, turn black, eventually die. So that's the hint to find statuettes. I mean, fair enough, it's just... Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Take that. <laughs> so now we're... It's a treasure hunt to look for the... Statuettes, basically. We only have one, by the way. I think. Where is it? Yeah. We need four, so... Yeah. I guess that means we haven't noticed one. Right, let's go through this path first. Right, well, we know what to look for, I guess. I haven't, I didn't actually notice the grass was black, so it wasn't terribly obvious. But yeah, we need four of these bad boys, so I just placed one. Right, so that's what it looks like. Okay, so... I don't know if this is really fun. So there's another up the hill. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember where this one is. No, not here. It's on this side. I feel like I'm doing a lot of busy work, huh? And then another one was in town? 
I was told. There's the hell. I thought it was back here. Are you sure there was a dick spy in town? I'll play a little bit more of this because I'm kind of intrigued. I'm kind of intrigued if this game can stop being so samey. Starring area? That'd be kind of bullshit, but possible. What about this area? I have a shovel now. I don't know if that matters. How do we plant that without a shovel, anyways? Yeah, I'm not sure where we're... I'm going to guess they're all kind of clumped around the same area, actually. Because they did seem clumped to the same area. Let's go back. So basically, anywhere past this point would probably be good, look, good to look around. Aren't you a dog? Why would you be able to dig a hole? It's a good question. I think the reason I didn't know is the black grass at first, like the black and grass, is because a lot of owls. It's because the corrupted grass is also a dark color, so I kind of just didn't notice. Alright. Player character sucks, he's not a dog. Black's is different from purple. Yeah, I just see dark colored grass, so I just think it's the same thing. Because I'm not paying attention to the grass. Why would I pay attention to the grass in a video game? Without being prompted, I mean. These dungeons are getting a little samey now. This game is perfectly fine, but I just feel there's something's missing here. I don't know what it is exactly. Actually, I might have a hunch. Oh. Oh, two. What's the point of a sw switch next to a locked door that just opens when I pull the switch? I don't... Alright. Oh. Hmm. I'll heal. Yes, it might be a dangerous trap, but hell! It can really, uh, it can really net some dough with that thing. Flat it out, make pancakes, something like that. I don't know. That's not what you do with dough. That's how you make pancakes. <laughs> I'm not a cook. That being said, I am going to make some nice grilled cheeses after this. Well, I put that on the thing, and that makes the water of evil go down. Goodbye, water of evil. Good. Which lets me go over here. I think I missed something on the other direction, but...
I'll get it on the way back. You know, I don't really care. There. I I'm tired of fighting those guys, so I was just like, you know what? If I kill him fast, yeah, you can only hit me twice. Probably could dodge the first attack you try, and, and if I get hit, just well on him. If I get hit, I can still dodge, but it's just like, ugh. They're not fun to fight, is what I'm trying to say. Wow, that does a lot of damage. I guess it should, though. Okay, never mind. We'll save the bolts for those assholes. Specifically the ones that move, I guess. Unless the ones that aren't moving are in a really bad position. These guys have, like, no bite range. They're kind of pathetic. Anyways, I've kind of figured out the flow of the game, so I can kind of run... Let's go the other way first. It has very limited ammo, that's why I'm going to save it for those guys. Ah. The sound, I guess the, the game design is too predictable. I'm missing a valve. The valve's over here. I just need to get around this, and then I can get it. Then I'll lower the water again. This is a bit of an odd trap, this one. Ow, ow. I wasn't sure the best way to do that. <laughs> There's the valve. That was an interesting trap placement, at the very least. That, has to make, that makes me have to think about the timing on it. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, what? <laughs> it has to go over here, baby. <laughs> and I gotta lower it more to go d Okay. Good thing there was a box there. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I like how it sounds like I'm just getting punched in the face when I jump in the green water of bad. It requires a very specific jump. I wonder if uh, I can... Nope, you can't! <laughs> if you're wondering if you could uh, dash teleport across, no. <laughs> no, no. That does not give you direct... direct uh, does not give you direction like that. Wait. For once I am stumped. Wait, no, I'm not. Oh no! Wait. Really? Oh, god damn it. I have to go back to the first dungeon. I saw one of these earlier. I didn't think of anything of it. I thought it was just a stone with a scratch on it. Yeah. There were more of those. Oh my goodness. Oh, hello. You're a new enemy. Um, how you doing? Oh, I see. You don't like walking. Are you healing? No, you're not. You're just being a jerk. Did you just try to kick me? <laughs> okay, excuse me. Love HP. Not a very hard enemy, though. Just fucking kick me. Right, so we, yeah, we missed a whole bunch of shit, apparently. Um... Cool. Cool. Was this a secret? I'm not really sure. See, they should learn from the Dark Souls uh, giant mushrooms. They they know how to land a mean punch. You don't kick as a mushroom, you punch as a mushroom. That's the, that's the lesson learned. Did I just... I don't know, did I open the gate or something? I don't know what I did. Let's see. Oh, it's available to the pool. Okay, well that did open the, What did I accomplish doing all that? Did I pick up a valve? Maybe I picked up a valve. I picked up a valve. I just didn't notice I did.
There was another secret room? Where? Oh wait, I know where. At least I have a hunch. Yep. I was wondering why there was a jump over here. Okay, we got a mask. Oh my god. So I'll have to backtrack through this dungeon and the other one with the same aesthetic, because that one had at least one scratchy panel. I saw it. I remember seeing it, so... Um, alright. We're done here now. But these jumps are a little bit tricky. The optional collectible? Yeah. Wonder what they serve the purpose of. Door. Nothing. Uh, rusted? Oh, god damn, I have to make another potion? But there's a big, big craft table here then. I mean, I, I can make another one. Oh wait, can I make another one? I'm not really sure. Where does this go? <laughs> Puts me on a high ledge that I can drop down from but not return up to. Oh, this is, no, this is completely new. <laughs> All right. And now I can craft the rust, I can fix the rust issue thing. Okay. Silly bombs for these. This game is formulaic, that's the word. Like, it's not really a bad game, but it just kind of follows a formula, and I'm not really sure what to say about that. Wow, oh, his bite range is weird. Let's just do that. Um, I don't know why, but this discount Shire music is really annoying me. Uh huh. Well, we hit our hour for we hit the howler for an hour mark, so props should just stop. I'm not sure. What to say I'm kind of curious about something though before I stop. Nope. Nope. If you're wondering, no, you can't just cheese it. I was really curious. Yeah, I'm done with this. I don't know, man. It's it's certainly competently made, but it just doesn't have any magic. It's very formulaic. It just kind of does what it does. Combat's fine, I guess. Enemy variety is mad. They don't do much. They're kind of actually, when you really think about the AI, is very simple. We've had two enemy types just kind of come at me. One of them stuck itself in the ground to defend randomly for a while, which didn't really add much. The other two enemies are either a stationary and moving version of that one enemy that just simply shoots wherever you are at a random interval. So the enemy design is boring. The fighting is simplistic. Uh, the world design feels unnecessarily convoluted. Like, I feel like all this wandering around I'm doing is really unnecessary, especially when it came to backtracking. Um... It's just, it's a point A to point B game, and it doesn't really provide much thing, it doesn't provide much to inspire me. So I'm just, it's very easy to see that game design of just, I go here, then go back over here, then go here. Like, it's, there's nothing interesting masking the fact that this is a video game with a video game sort of formula. <laughs> it's not a bad game, but it's not really a good game either. This kind of falls under one of those, eh, categories, you know? It's the hardest game to review. It's the hardest type of game to review because it's not like notably bad or even like entertainingly bad. It just exists. It's fine. But is fine good enough in today's day and age of as many of the games as there are to play? I don't think so. 
That was Mask of Mists.